At Taylor, we're always checking the pulse of the esports industry. And here with me to discuss college and high school gaming is Tyler Schrote, founder and CEO of EGF. Tell us what your organization, EGF, has been busy doing in the last six months. So the last six months, we've really been focused on the expansion and development of our model that kind of helps bring esports to a college or to a high school um, in a way that sort of bridges the gap between the players, which would normally be the students, obviously, uh, and the administrators who may not be as familiar. I recently went to Rutgers University mm -hmm. and I met with a couple of the students there. They're not into the competition. They're really more into just being involved in a community. Probably 70 to 80 percent on any given campus, whether it's a high school or a college, uh, would self-identify as a gamer. It doesn't necessarily mean that they want to compete and they want to go play League of Legends professionally, but they like being a part of a community that sort of has that common thread. Similar to professional gaming, there's been significant change and interest coming from NCAA um, and other organizations in college and high school esports. It's really sort of been one of those things that's been building for a super long time and then suddenly everybody started to realize what was going on and started to get more directly involved. So um, as you started to see more universities offer scholarship programs, that's increased exponentially, especially over the last six months. How do you feel corporate sponsors can best engage with college gamers? And what are some brands that are most appropriate? I think a lot of it is actually pretty similar to what they've done traditionally on a college campus. I mean, if you work with uh, a group like IMG, for instance, there's all sorts of really cool activations that can be done that kind of specify or tailor that brand to that unique campus. And a lot of the things that we're trying to build uh, at EGF kind of allows brands to engage more directly. Um, there's certainly a lot of opportunities to engage with clubs before they kind of get to that formalized process, um, but the same type of opportunities are there for, for pretty much any brand that wants to get involved. Um, there's been a ton of brands that have done some really great things in the space already, and I think that translates really well to a, a college campus, and I think you'll see um, brands like Nationwide and Coca-Cola and others that you know already have a pretty significant pro uh, presence on a lot of campuses start to expand uh, their budgets and their spending to sort of, uh, sort of supplement some of the things they're already doing. Mm -hmm.